Hi, my name is Derek Salamanca, and today we're going to the Stingray City in the Grand Cayman Islands. The tour, which costs about 40 bucks, starts off on a trip to the canal, which is kind of cool because you can see all the rich houses and their rich boats and how they can just take their boats right up to their houses. And then once you get out, um, it's, it's a pretty short ride out there. You're not going very far out into the ocean. This is by far the bluest water I've ever seen. Now as you're watching the video, you're going to realize very quickly that my mom starts getting afraid of the stingrays. And I made a video about just her being afraid of the stingrays, which you can find in the description below. One thing I did not like about the tour is that the tour guides try to get you in like group photos and stuff, which a lot of people do like, so I'm not really trashing it, but I just personally didn't like it. So I went off my own and just went swimming with the stingrays because that's what I was there for, not the pictures because I have my GoPro. But a lot of why you were there was just them keeping everybody together trying to do like group activities when you just want to swim with stingrays. At one point they gave us food for the stingrays and taught you how to feed them. And they suck the food out of your hand like a vacuum cleaner. It's the craziest feeling. Oh, that's cool! Oh, <laughs> Here, take it! Oh, oh. Ah. oh my God. My mom was afraid of getting stung, and I think some of you might be, but you don't really have to worry about it. You just don't step on them. Just shuffle your feet or just swim along. They bump into you themselves, so they're not really afraid of you. So you'd have to actually, like, be retarded to get stung, I think. Like, my mom was freaking out about it. But no, no, nobody there got stung, and I think it's very rare that people do. So just jump your feet, swim along, and don't like hit them, <laughs> and you'll be fine. After we went to the Stingray City section, which was far too short in my mind, we went snorkeling, which was far too long in my mind. I think they should have reversed them. Um, so if you're gonna book a tour, I would find out how long you're actually at Stingray City itself, like actually in the water with the stingrays. Because we weren't there very long, it seemed like a half hour is just not long enough in my mind. Now, the snorkeling was cool, but you're not going to see any big fish. They're all like little tiny fish. We didn't see any turtles, which kind of sucked. But it was just small, little colorful fish. And it was pretty pretty, and it was nice to do for sure. I just wish there was bigger fish. Or sharks. We booked our tour through the Captain Marvin's company. But you don't really need to worry about which company you're choosing because you're just driving out to the same location these other boats are going. So you're not really hanging out on the boat too much. This company does pick you up with a shuttle bus and drops you off from your to and from your hotel as long as you're within a certain area. The entire trip is about two and a half hours long. I don't not recommend this company, but I also don't recommend it. There's a lot of companies out there and they're all around the same prices and times. Personally, if I did it again, I would search longer for how long I'm at Stingray Island. That's the main thing you want to do. The snorkeling is not as cool as the Stingray Islands. So if you're going to look, I would look for how long you're actually at Stingray or Stingray City. I keep saying Stingray Island. I also made a full video of my trip to Grand Cayman. You can find that in the description below, as well as a link for this company. Also, there's a link for the One Eye Digest, which is an awesome classified ad website. So check that out. And I'm assuming you guys like the outdoors, and if you're single and you like the outdoors, you should check out lovebird.com. It's an awesome dating app for people who like the outdoors. So the link for that website is in the description below. Again, my name is Derek Salamanca. If I didn't answer any questions um, or cover anything in the video that you want to know about, shoot me a message or shoot me a comment. I'm always answering them, and I'll def definitely respond to you. And in the description below, I'm going to have a bunch of other videos of certain sections of my Grand Cayman Island trip, as well as the whole video. So make sure you watch all those as well. Um, subscribe if you like the stuff. I have new videos coming out, but they're going to come out randomly because i got a busy, busy schedule. Um, so I hope you liked it. Again, my name is Eric Salamanca, and I hope to see you on the next video.